If you've never used a screen casting software before, I have several of them on here. You can see this one called AZ Screencast. I have another one called Easy Screen. Here's how I'm putting my video on my Google Drive. So whether you have an Apple iPhone or an Android phone, um, the way to do it is the same way. I'm going to go into my Google Drive. Drive. I'm going to navigate to my correct account because I have several accounts. So this is my Google Drive. I'm just going to put it in lesson plans for now. On yours, you should create a folder and call it screencasts or presentations. I like to have things at the top. If you'll notice this top one says peers lessons. I'm going to create a new folder by tapping the plus. Create a new folder. I'm going to call this underscore underscore zero underscore screencasts. Or you know what? Let's just call it videos. Click done. It's now my second one in line. Those two underscores put it at the top of your list. So I'm going to add that thing to this. File upload. Recent. Oh, wait a minute. Sorry. Getting a little backwards here. I got to go find the video on my desktop. So I'm going to go to my files. This is the one I just created, so I'm going to hold that down and click Share or Tap Share. And I'm going to put it in my Google Drive. So Save to Drive. I'm going to rename it. Info Sheet. Underscore. A student. No, I'm not going to do a student. I'm going to do J wing underscore period 48. Okay, the reason I'm doing period 48 is 48 is one of my favorite numbers, and the two classes I teach are periods 4 and 8. So yours will have either a P4 or a P8. I'm going to click done and save, and it's going to upload that file to my Google Drive associated with my um, school account because as I said I have Google Drive for several other accounts. So that's how you upload it. I'll create another video on how to put it in your Google site and also how to turn it in.